Tags can be a great organizational tool in files. If you use them on a Mac, they can also sync with the Files app when using iCloud Drive. Currently, I have three tags available in Files. One file has been assigned the purple work tag, two have the blue home tag, and none have the red tag applied yet. So let's see how we can apply tags to files or folders. I'll start by tagging the sample invoice document here. To do so, I'm going to tap and hold on it to bring up the options bar above and move over to tags. In here we can just tap on existing tags to assign it to the file. Or I can add a new tag, which I can name and assign a color for if I want. I'll make this one green and call it finances. So this file is now assigned the finances tag. But we can assign multiple tags to a file or folder. So I'm going to assign the work tag to this one as well. Now over on the iPad, the sample invoice document appears when I select the finance or work tags in the browse sidebar. To remove a tag, just tap and hold on the file or folder again, tap tags, and then tap on the tag that you want to remove. I'll remove the work tag from this file. Now I'm going to assign the red tag to the mail attachments folder. But this time, I'm going to tap and drag the folder over to the red tag in the sidebar. Doing so assigns the red tag to the folder, but not to the files within it. They remain untagged. You can also drag and drop to tag on an iPhone. You will need to use two fingers to do so, though. One to drag the file or folder, and the other to tap the back button to view the tags in the sidebar. I'll assign this to the work tag. So now we can view folders that have been assigned tags and then tap on those folders to view the files within them. But what if you want to tag several or all the files in a single folder? To do that, we have to use drag and drop and select multiple. So if I want to select all the files here in the finances folder and apply the finances tag to them, I need to tap and drag on one and then use another finger to tap on the other files that I want, which will be added to the first file that I started dragging. Then drag them all over the finances tag. Tags can also be added and managed from the info panel for any file or folder. Tap here at the bottom to move into the tags panel where I can assign, remove, or create new tags. If I bring up a finder window on my Mac, notice that the new finance tag is available here, and the other tags have synced as well. So tags can be a great way to organize files without needing to worry about exactly which folder they're in. As long as they're assigned a certain tag, they will always appear under that tag in the browse sidebar.